Welcome back to News 8 at 6. In Cumberland County this weekend, Carlisle Events is putting on its second annual sports and outdoor show. In the crowd, you'll find a man who never meant to be a wildlife artist, but as News 8 Cumberland County reporter Matt Barcaro shows us, he's now getting a lot of attention. Artists can find inspiration just about anywhere. And when you put it on stone, even the fly line looks almost real. But sometimes their greatest works stones. of art don't have a bunny. Come from within. But stick around long enough, I keep doing it for quite a long time, I'll come up with a bunny. And that's how Bruce Dellinger lives his life. Not bad for an old boy from Virginia. You do a great job. It's just that he never would have guessed he'd be living his life like this. It wouldn't have been a pretty accident. A lot of things would have been different. <laughs> when Bruce was 14 years old, he fell off a hayloft and lost most control of his arms and legs. He was devastated, even suicidal. Well, after I had my accident, basically I couldn't go out and play sports, things like that. So it was my aunt who suggested I take up oil painting. Turns out a number two pencil turned into his second chance. It slowly progressed into just losing yourself in another world and totally forgetting about everything else. Bruce loses himself in wildlife scenes he has never seen before. I don't know. But they're in his head. It's one of those things, I reckon. And he's getting attention for them. Awards, second glances. I really like it. And customers. You lose some things, but God always gives you a gift for something else. And this is just, these are just wonderful. Bruce knows how he draws. I'll bite down and hold it and just go. Is part of what makes his art stand out. <laughs> but the fact that he can draw and loves it is what's gotten him this far. It'll come. And when you think about it, that. It's all about time and patience, man. Is a thing of beauty. In Carlisle, Matt Barcaro, News 8. Bruce's work will be on display and for sale at the Carlisle Fairgrounds. The Carlisle Sports and Outdoor Show runs through Sunday afternoon. Okay, time, patience, and talent. We go to break now with a live look. Look at this beautiful sunset from our Ephrata Sky Cam. Parts of the Susquehanna Valley, though, do remain under a flash flood warning. Chief Meteorologist Joe Calhoun will have the latest on the forecast when we come right back.